Hello everybody, I am just Lance and I'm Michael. Michael, my boy. Anyways, we would like to welcome you all back for another video. Um, I wanted to do this video with me and Michael yesterday. It's February 1st, 2023. I wanted to do it with him yesterday because yesterday was his ninth birthday. Um, so we went ahead, wasn't able to get to the video yesterday, so we're doing it um, tonight. Anyways, and on this shave, Michael picked out every single item I'm using in the video, except the blade. Anyways, the razor he chose was my Icon B2 Open Comb razor with the DLC coating on the head. In case you are new to this, DLC means diamond. <coughs> He's got a little bit of a cough, guys. And the handle is the OSS, Icon OSS handle, and it's all stainless steel. I might blow my nose a couple of times, though. Yeah, well, you're going to have to. And um, the blade is a Voskot on its third use. Michael, why was it you chose this razor for this shave? I don't know. I mean, it looked expensive. <laughs> it looked expensive? You did say it was about 100 Yeah, right? yeah it was close to 100 But anyways... So what is it you like about the razor? It looks very nice. It's also silver. This? That's stainless steel, buddy. It looks Anyways. silver. Okay. The brush he chose is my Razor Rock Hulk with a 24 mil or 34 millimeter knot. Very furry. It is a synthetic. He calls it furry. And why did you choose the Hulk brush? Because it's big and it's furry. Like it's really big furry. and it's furry. Okay, that works for me. And the like a soap. Nice to use. And the soap. Where's the soap? Let me put the lid on it. The soap is, which was a gift from Christian. <coughs> you okay, bud? Yes. Anyways, the soap is K Shave Works Cherry Fuge. Just has a lovely, lovely cherry scent. And why was it you chose this one? It smells good. It smells good. That's right. Can't argue with that. Well, I want a whiff. I want you want a whiff? Okay. Yeah, well, I want... Get a smell of that. Hold on. It smells very nice. All right. We're going to take a break so he can blow his nose. Go ahead and blow your yes. nose. And for the lather bowl, it's actually a Campbell's Scottish Broth Soup Mug. It has on one side, not sure which side. Is that the side with all the ingredients? Yes. On this side, it has all the ingredients for Scottish broth. One of these times I'm going to make it. Never had Scottish broth, but hey, I'm willing to try. Helicopter, helicopter. And we'll go ahead and lather it up. Okay, Mikey. What? Go ahead and hop down. Oh, wait. Why did you choose the, the soup mug? I don't know. You just thought it'd be cool to use? I thought it would be good to use. Okay. Go ahead and hop down. That way so I don't bang into you while I'm shaving. Good idea. Are you going to hang out here with me? Or are you going to go ahead and are you going to head out? I'm going to stay here Okay. For a while. Move the stool. That way I don't trip over it. I'm going to stay here for a while. I might go back outside. Back into the living room. Alright. I might join in again. That's fine. Alright. We're going to go ahead and wipe, uh, wet this synthetic beast down. And go ahead and uh, use it. Nice thing about a synthetic brush, if you're new to this style of wet shave, uh, this style of shaving, is you don't oh, gotta we, soak them. On Hang on, guys. Watch. Don't we have to, don't we have to show off the um, aftershave? Oh, okay. Go ahead and hold it up and show them. Okay. The aftershave is Florida water. It smells like Coke. Yep. Do not drink it. Uh, of course do, not, buddy. Do not drink it. It's, it's not Coke, but it smells like it. All right, go ahead and move the stool, buddy. All right. I'm loud. Watch all this water, buddy. Oh. Oh, that's satisfying. Mm -hmm. That's extremely. Been letting the 
soap kind of bloom there. So I'm going to wet my face bloom. real quick and wipe the bloom water on it. I want to watch. Put yeah. a nice little layer of I'm so slickness on there. Hey, Dad, have you ever met a fan in real life? Uh, well, I've talked to a couple, some people that subscribe to the channel. Talked Ooh. to a couple of them. My friend Guy, he subscribed to the channel. He's also a YouTuber himself. Guy Solis, he's got his own channel. You say no. And then me and my friend Dennis, <coughs> who actually sent me this brush, oh, um, nice. and a, a bunch of other stuff over the past few years. Um, you know, we talk back and forth sometimes on Messenger. And, uh, then my friend Christian, yeah. he's also a subscriber. Isn't he your brother? No, no, Christian ain't my brother. Me and him are close. We're really good friends. Oh, I... We're like brothers, kind of. Why did I think he was your brother? Well, you're both. And your Uncle Cuckoo? He's a subscriber. Anyways, I'm gonna cut away a lot of this. That way, so the brush ain't clinking on the saran on the inside of the mug. All right, guys. Let me dry my hands. Anyways, got the soap lathered up. wasn't able to really get whipping around in the mug with the Razor Rock Hulk because big brush. But look at that. Oh, what just fell? Probably a little bit of lather. Oh. Nice. Mm-hmm. This is actually a really good head shaving brush. Uh, I had to fail. And, uh, you know, it covers up. It covers a lot of real estate really quick. <coughs> so much lather. Mm-hmm. Why is it flinging everywhere? Good. Sometimes wet shaving is a messy business, son. Seems like it. Nice slick lather. Nice. Nice lather here. Mm, getting out. Mm. <laughs> yeah, got it up around my mouth. Oh, you got it in your mouth. Like... Yeah, it don't taste like cherries, son. It does not taste like cherries. <laughs> good. Doesn't yeah, it's good because there'd probably be some people out there that would get get feeling froggy and grab a spoon and start chowing. Yeah, and that would basically poison their. No, I wouldn't poison them. It sure wouldn't make them feel well. I don't think it'd poison them, but boy. I think it would poison them. Well, yeah, if they eat like, too much, yeah. but I'm pretty sure that after a couple of bites, they'd be like, ah, this ain't for me. All right. All right. We're all lathered up. Let me rinse a little bit of soap off the handle. My handle is both sides. These are shotguns. <laughs> <coughs> Run the blade under some hot water, warm it up, and then here we go. First pass with the grain. Listen, Michael, listen. Hear that sound? Oh my god, that's so satisfying. Yeah, it is actually. Bro, why is that so satisfying? Oh my. Oh. I got myself a wet shaver in the making, guys. It's just so satisfying because people love certain sounds. It's so relaxing. Oh my God. Wow. Oh yeah. Well, remember, Michael, you got yourself a pretty decent little razor collection I've been building up for you. Yes, I know. 
When I grow up, I get some of your razors. For all I'll have. pass some of them on to you before I'm gone, but, you know. Yeah, you will. You're my dad. There's so. razors that, well, There's hopefully you won't get for a very long time to come. Why? Because I want to be around to use them for years. Oh. But, let's see here, you got a 74 super speed <coughs> in the case, a 40s fat handle tech, a um, 41 aristocrat, a Merker 34C, and a couple others in there, I do believe if I remember correctly. Super. Soup is in my mind. <laughs> you got soup on the brain, son? Yes. Well, you just had a soup for dinner. And it was good. All right, look at that. Michael took it all down. Nice. First pass done. Go ahead and rinse off. I'll be back. All right, that first pass down. That was a very good pass. The Voskhod blade is on its third use. Still going strong. And the razor just performing beautifully. Soup. And, you know, what can I say about the brush other than it's really big, but, you know, feels really good on the face, this plus, plus soft style knot. Yeah, I was looking on Vanule's website the other day, and I was looking at their knots. That she sells there. Just seeing what she's got. And she's got some. Because this is nearly too big for me. This would be a perfect head shaver like I said. Or if you. <coughs> you okay bud? Yes. Or if you, you know, shaved your body. It'd be a great brush. But she's got some knots on her website. That are 39 millimeter knots. Hey yo, hold up. What did you just say? This is a big knot. I've seen ones that are actually bigger than this. Bada bing. I'm interested in checking out a couple of her knots. She has one. It's called, what, a Hercules knot? Hercules? Yep, it's called a Hercules knot. Hercules is involved in this? Yeah, the name. Soup. Alright. Okay. <coughs> oh my goodness, son. Yeah, he's taking cough medicine and tomorrow I gotta take tomorrow. His mom's gonna take him into urgent care and get him checked out. And it just seems like this time of the year he just gets sick constantly. Plus he's got really gnarly allergies. Yeah, if if you are looking at icon. I'm a poor child. <laughs> yeah. Well, we ain't rich, that's for sure. But if you're looking at any razors on icon, and you want one with great knurling, this OSS handle has outstanding knurling. Cross the growth. Oh, almost went into my mustache. That's nice. Don't want to do that. Why? Because I'm trying to grow it. Oh, right. MK47. <laughs> yeah, my hand, fingers are wet and I'm holding the br uh, razor and... You got a child with you as well. And... Yes, Papa. And, uh... It's just not slippy at all.
guilt. Yeah, sit down, we, me and Cindy, my girlfriend, one moment, let me rinse off and I'll be back for the third and final pass. <coughs> All right, we'll sit there and do a quick paint on for the third and final pass. At least the one nice thing about this big of a knot is you don't got to do a lot of swipes with it to go ahead and apply lather. Yeah, that, that, that Scottish broth mug, that was my very, very first lathering vessel, as I like to call them. Back in 2014 when I started it, my mom was like, uh, I want to give it to you against the grain pass up at an angle and uh, she actually gave me a tomato soup one that had a recipe for tomato soup but I I know a lot of people love it I cannot stand tomato soup I hate tomato soup to me it's like drinking <coughs> runny, runny warm ketchup but my brother loves tomato soup and Ooh, when, Uncle Cuckoo. Yeah, when I got him into wet shaving or he got into soup. wet shaving. Um my mom gave him that Scottish broth one and I was like, dude, I can't stand tomato soup. You like it? You wanna trade? He's like, Yeah, sure. I got my friend Christian hooked on wet shaving. And uh, when he came out to visit it and he wanted to try wet shaving, he uh My mom ended up giving him, I forget which one it was, she ended up giving him a mug because, you know, she grew up in the 40s. A little bit right there. And she always saw her grand, my granddad, lathering up with a soap and a mug. So she's like, "You gotta have a, you gotta have a mug when you do that type of shaving." Anyways, that's the third pass. Let me rinse off and be back for the alum. Oh yeah, the Icon B2. In case anybody's curious, the B2 stands for Bulldog Two. There's, oh, missed a little bit of soap. There is a B1 they made. I don't know if they still make it. I think they discontinued it. I'm not sure. No, I think they still have the B1. It's the B2 they discontinued. Possibly. I don't know. Um, I might be wrong about that. Soap. But uh, soap. the B1, the Bulldog 1, has a standard bar. And the Bulldog 2 has the open comb. And I was going to do some shout outs, but I forgot to get the names. Um, so, <coughs> I'll go ahead and... Get those names 
here later. Not in the next shave, the next face shave, because I'm going to do a head shave. So we'll go ahead and uh, get that. No, I could bring them up on my Gmail and see who's who subscribed for the head shave. I'll do that. A little bit of singing on the neck and underneath the chin. But the cheeks, hardly any at all. All right. Anyways, we'll sit in here. Uh, I'll let this set for a few. And then I'll go ahead and rinse off. And I'll cut away, shave my head, and then I'll be back for the post.